What do you think about using uh, AI for polymorphic and metamorphic attacks? Uh, as in, as in just uh, uh, the crafting? Uh, the crafting, exactly. So like before we had to write the code basically that yeah. mutated the payload in order to, you know, bypass different I mean, antivirus software. I, I mean, I think it's great because we don't have to write it. I mean, and I think if you train the model accordingly oh. to, uh, <laughs> to uh, um, actually understand, hey, these are the kind of mutations that I want to apply, right? And you say, hey, gen uh, this is the original payload mutated on this form. Even, even if you look at it from the offensive side, you can have the model even use tools for you and that does it for you. And it doesn't have, even have to understand um, have the right uh, algorithm to create the mutation. It just needs code execution and capabilities to just generate the, the Python script or whatever. Absolutely. And it's going to do it for you. I think it's the way to go. I don't know. <laughs> I agree. So, like, it's, it's not just a new ways of, you know, finding things and uh, defending against things. Uh, the, the entire industry is going to be uprooted from that perspective. And I think, you know, polymorphic, metamorphic is a good example to show where things are going. You, you will not be able to catch, a human will not be able to catch those kind of things. So it's going to be AI against AI kind of deal. Yeah.